I used to do the Stations of the Cross with my mother. At our church, we'd kneel and pray in front of the 14 depictions of Jesus' last journey to crucifixion and death. My mother would read to me from a pamphlet that had the meditations for each station. I store up the image of his agony in my heart, knowing that I will never again feel alone in my suffering. My mother would finish reading, she'd point to me and she'd say, that's how much you are loved. Later in my teen years, my mother died and several of my friends died and I lost my faith. Then one day, many years later as an adult, a spiritual counselor said to me, Sue, why don't you just tell God how angry you are at him? Well, I didn't believe in God. Why would I talk to him? Slowly, with her help, I dove underneath all those feelings of anger and grief, and I felt met by a peaceful present that surpasses all understanding. I remembered the words of the station's prayer, knowing that I will never again feel alone in my suffering, and I no longer did.